This is the moment that every mixed martial arts athlete hopes will materialize the number one heavyweight contender making the walk for his first title fight here in the UFC. I mean, the nerves are going crazy for this man right now. He's so nervous. Has he done everything he needs to do? Has he not left any stone unturned? He says that he has prepared. He says that his body's ready. His mind's ready. He feels physically good in the spot. He's taking on a long-rated champion. If he's gonna get this done, it's gonna take something truly special. He does not believe jitters will be a factor here tonight. He has built his career methodically to this point. We'll see if we hear the words and new by night 10. Tyson with this DMX intro backdrop. I'm anxious as if I'm fighting. This is a huge moment for the history of mixed martial arts and for the International Boxing Hall of Famer, Mike Tyson. It all works together. It really just all works together whenever you watch Mike Tyson from the song to the, the look, to the bobbing of the head, to the posse. Iron Mike Tyson is just one of those guys that draws you in. And he is bringing a lot of new eyes to the UFC octagon. He can wrestle a little bit too, John, so don't be surprised if on the first shot, Mike Tyson hits him with the big sprawl to defend his leg. Only thing I can guarantee you, he's not going to be taking any bites of cauliflower ear <laughs> in the octagon tonight. We're certainly happy to have Mike Tyson. Let's see how it goes. The baddest man on the planet, Mike Tyson is ready to go, and that means so are we for our main event. And now let's get you our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. We send it inside the octagon, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. fight stays upright, that is a problem for the opposition. His misses are entertaining. And he caught the kick. Oh, making this clinch work count. Lands the punch there. Beautiful job getting those hands up. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Straight punch is true. I mean, these guys are letting it fly. What a pace they're fighting that. Man, back and forth we go, and early on, these guys getting after it. They told us it would be fun, and so far, they've delivered. Tyson gets caught by the straight punch. Another punch to the head. 
All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean, and now a cut has opened up. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Now going upstairs with the left hook. Well, this striker knows one direction, that is forward. He knows one style, that is aggressive. And that's exactly what we've seen today. He has every intent of overwhelming every guy who steps into the octagon. Just over three minutes now to go. pretty good, but didn't sort of smell blood in the water, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, blood's in the water. You gotta go get it. You gotta go find the bitch. You cannot let him off the hook like that, because now he will be motivated to try to go and hurt you. As you well, significant swelling now in and around that left eye. Might even be starting to close. Grips the body there. Certainly showing look like it did stun him a little bit. Big right hand. All right, so look at that. A cut has been opened around that eye area. He's taking shots over and over again to that area, and now he's dealing with a cut. Attempts the uppercut there, but it doesn't land. All right, so a wise decision by him to continue to attack that cut. And it's getting wider by the minute. It's getting wider by the minute. This guy is, is, is a fantastic fighter. And he's as smart as they come. So the moment that cut opened up, you knew that that would become his focus. And we are seeing it very clear right now. Back to the jab now. No good. Going out of the body with that hook. Well done there by Tyson. Oh, his right eye keeps taking damage. Looking pretty swollen now. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Flipped him with the jab. Big shots being landed on both sides here. strike upstairs and for his opponent that is certainly not going to help matters when it comes to the swell he can't miss Jay. and when you saw the swelling initially you knew that he needed to change something he still has not changed that and while it's getting worse it's still not at a point where we should panic but a few more and he's going to find himself in a dire situation well he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume his opponent sees the target but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. There's the jab, there's another one. So the double jab is there by Tyson. Oh! Oh! Oh, continuing to attack the head as that diving punch lands. We might get a stoppage here soon. Using a lot of good movement. Second round, straight ahead. All right, so the round is over. You see, obviously, the fighter has a cut on his cheek sustained in that round, but better to be below the eye than above it. The cut man is in there trying to close it up. Well, he had a lot more than a puncher's chance coming in. Big knockdown for him in the previous round. DC, talk us through the highlight. He got in his opponent's face, landed that big punch that put his opponent flat on his back. He couldn't get the finish, but if he lands one more time just like that, he will get the victory. Ready to fight. Ready. Round two here. Oh, defense into offense there as he blocks the strike and counters with a perfect jab. Man, his jab is good. There it is.
cannot take those leg kicks clean like that. Really starting to bleed profusely out of that eye. It's not looking good, champ. Well, it's leaking down his face. The guy's been beat up, and now this cut has become a real issue. Well, you know, Rogan's pissed he missed this one. We are witnessing an instant classic. Back and forth we go. Both fighters have been on the cusp of being finished, and both have exuded a ton of heart. Yeah, they both show heart, courage, ability, technical skills. I can't really tell you how these two are still in the fight with the damage. That, that is it! Oh, holy smoke! Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Here now, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 57 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. Well, who would have thought that the former boxing champion Iron Mike Tyson would become a bona fide UFC contender? This win tonight is certainly a step in the right direction. He had a lot of doubters and naysayers coming into this one, but Mike Tyson gets his hand raised, and it seems like no matter the sport, no matter the combat setting, when the stakes are the highest, when the lights are the brightest, Mike Tyson rises to the occasion. He most